Why did Meta's stock plummet 10% despite beating earnings expectations? It's a question that has investors and tech enthusiasts scratching their heads. Meta, the tech giant formerly known as Facebook, recently reported impressive first quarter numbers. Sales skyrocketed to $36.46 billion, marking a 27% increase from last year. Earnings per share? A whopping $4.71 outperforming forecasts. But the plot thickens. Despite these outstanding numbers, Meta's stock took a dive. The culprit? Meta's forecast for the upcoming quarter signaled a considerable slowdown in growth. The projected sales of $36.5 to $39 billion fell short of analysts' expectations. This unexpected news sent ripples through the market, leading to a 10% drop in Meta's stock price in limited trading. But there's more to the story. Meta also increased its full-year expense outlook, attributing the rise to its costly Metaverse projects. This shift from efficient growth to increased expenses didn't sit well with shareholders. Now let's not forget Meta's journey. It faced its fair share of challenges. From a record high to a massive dip, it weathered the storm. And now, despite the stock dip, it's back on top, thanks to its resilient ad business. But here's a fact that might leave you gobsmacked. Meta's Metaverse division reported a staggering $3.8 billion loss last quarter, adding to its $37 billion operating loss over the past two and a half years. Yet, amidst all this, CEO Mark Zuckerberg isn't losing sleep. A whopping dividend payment of $172.7 million is on the horizon. His fortune now stands at over $173 billion, making him the fourth richest person globally. Quite the journey from where he started, isn't it? So to sum it up, Meta's stock dip can be attributed to its underwhelming growth forecast and increased expense outlook. But with Zuckerberg at the helm, who knows what's next for this tech titan? The story of Meta is far from over, 